51 people were either killed or injured in auto pedestrian accidents in Oklahoma back in 2008. That's the latest number uh, available. But wouldn't it be great if someone developed a pedestrian detection system for cars? Well, no sooner said than done, almost. Volvo has the technology on one of its new models. And as Rick Wells shows us, they're showing it off right now. This is video from an auto pedestrian accident from a few years ago. Wouldn't it be great if there were a system to help prevent those kind of accidents? It uses two pieces of technology. Angelo and Gotti is showing me the brand new 2011 Volvo S60. It has a revolutionary pedestrian detection system. There's a radar in the grill and a camera up near the rear view mirror. The images from both are fed into a computer. It will then compare the shape of the object that's in front to over 10,000 stored human images that are on a hard drive in there. If it recognizes it as a human, the computer stops the car. So I got in for a test ride. Photojournalist Ty Lewis stayed outside to watch. Okay, here we go. We're rolling at about 15, 20 miles an hour. The beeping is designed to alert the driver, give him a chance to react himself. The driver should always be in control. This is strictly a backup. He also said this is the first version of this type system in any car. It's designed to recognize humans, not dogs or bicycles or deer. If this proves successful, other images could be added to the memory. Well, this time, Ty got in for an inside view. I'm coast in. <laughs> Hang on. It's not taking the place of responsible driving. It's there to help you out. We That's at least the second time he said that. Now, Just a backup to your own driving. I wonder if this thing can detect motorcycle cops masquerading as used cars on the lot across the street. Hmm. Rick Wells, the News on 6. Well, Volvo is demonstrating the new technology at Volvo Tulsa. That's at 41st and South Memorial. The demo continues at Jackie Cooper Imports tomorrow evening from 5 to 7.